This is Melanie Fine from Chem and 10. Today we're going to show flame tests, which are colors given off by different metal salts. What I purchased here is boric acid, commonly used as roach cleaner. This is like 99% boric acid. You can only buy this at a local hardware store, not at the chain stores like Home Depot or Lowe's. Table salt, sodium chloride, salt substitute, which is potassium chloride, and some copper sulfate. What I did is I mixed these with a little alcohol to help them burn. I fashioned a wire out of a cork and a paper clip. And take a little bit of the salt mixture. Remember why these flame tests turn these colors. The flame excites the electrons. The electrons are in their energy levels around the nucleus of an atom. When there's sufficient energy, an electron gets excited, and when it goes back and relaxes to its previous state, it emits the energy of the light, the color of light equal to the frequency or the energy of that energy transition. So that's why each metal has its characteristic color, because no two atoms have the same two energy levels. They all have energy level 1, 2, 3, 4, or 5, but the differences between the energy levels in different atoms are different. So, for our table salt, that's pretty easy to get. You and that burns a characteristic orange flame. Potassium chloride, on the other hand, should, the potassium should burn a purple or lavender flame. And copper sulfate, it's blue, but it burns that characteristic green color. That's how you make flames of many different colors. To find out more, visit chemin10.com. I'm Melanie Fine, and this is Chemin 10.